From Ankara to Anchorage, welcome and welcome back, fellow fans of Clash of Clans. It's your host, Galadon, and it's not often that I create a video because of one simple comment, but I thought, you know, there's a couple of things that happened with this base that made this worthy of a video. And speaking of, if you think this channel is worthy of a follow, please consider subscribing so that we can try to maintain the 1.9 million subs that we have. Uh, the channel being over 10 years old has a lot of people that outgrew Clash, but apparently you haven't. So thank you for, for, for being here. Okay, so let's talk about the Southern Teaser Base, oftentimes showcased on my live streams at kick.com slash Galadon. Really, there's one of two ways to annihilate this base with ease. Oftentimes, we see this exact strategy, people using the Invis Clone Super Archer Blimp from the right-hand side, and they get massive value annihilating all of those focused defenses right there near the Town Hall. And to be honest, it doesn't really matter that much what happens after that entry because you've just taken out so many powerful defenses that most armies, ground and air, can successfully finish the three star. The good news is most don't, and right around 5,000 trophies, I am currently averaging 1.43 stars per defense and only losing about 16 and a half trophies on every single defense, making this a fantastic base if you're looking to just hang right around 5,000 trophies in Legend League and you don't want to have to work too hard to push higher. And you know that I've argued many times in the past, there is little use in pushing the entire month of Legend League. Unless you are a 6,000 plus trophy player, just push the last 10 days and you'll find you'll get up to about your trophy max. Now, this next defense definitely belonged in a video because... Well, that's a Town Hall 15 that is about to annihilate my base. And I know, I know, offense is so OP right now that Town Hall 11s are out there destroying max 16s. I'm sure you could show me a video. But nonetheless, I was very impressed by the fact that this guy came in as a 15 with dragons, no less. Dragons and completely annihilated my base. I love the clones. Watch for the cloned balloons that are just going to explode over the town hall and get crazy value. This was such a fun attack to watch right here. Look at the town hall. Look at the balloons everywhere. And yeah, great value. A lot of fun. And also, I think that those may be some of the best looking dragons, level 10 dragons in the game right now. So congrats to Jamal Maximus for absolutely annihilating what is a fully maxed out Town Hall 16 with his Town Hall 15 army. So who knew the Southern teaser base that normally provides fun entertainment value for Town Hall 16's failing against me brought more entertainment value from a really well executed and a little bit lucky right here at the end attack. I mean, man, he comes really close to not quite finishing the job. I found myself rooting him on at this point. Come on, you've got this. Sure enough, the Archer Queen's ability, and he does wipe me out. But if you would like to try this base at your own risk, make sure you check out the recent best base ever video that I put out on the Southern Teaser. Give it a try at Town Halls 16 and 15, 14, 13. It also works. Thank you for watching all the way to the end of today's episode. Now it is time to get out there, make the best of the rest of your day, week, month, and year. Be kind to other people, animals, and the planets. And of course, I hope to see you all back here again tomorrow for more full attacks. Galadon, I invented that base. Why are you stealing my ideas again? Hmm?